If you are like me, watching someone yawn will make you yawn as well. It is regarded as one of the most common unconscious behaviors that we exhibit. But yawning is not only limited to humans. Almost all animals and birds yawn, from common pets like dog and cats to wild animals like tigers. Even fetuses yawn in the first trimester of pregnancy. Since this act of yawning is so common, in today's video we will look at why we yawn, how it affects us, and most importantly, how come it is so contagious that every time we see someone yawning, we do the same. The most common theory that you might have heard on why we yawn is that it helps bring in more oxygen in your blood and dish out carbon dioxide. But this theory is incorrect as there is no proof that a yawn increases the flow of oxygen. However, recent studies have shown that a yawn is like a cooling system for our brain. Just like a laptop or a phone gets hot with continuous use, our brain's temperature also varies depending on the activity we are doing. Exhaustion, tiredness and sleep deprivation are examples of such activities. Our brain tends to perform best at a certain temperature and heats up on continuous intensive work. Yawning increases the heart rate and blood flow in our body, which are essential in cooling our brain. Inhaling cool air also helps control the overall body temperature. It is thus a signal from the brain that it is tired and needs a fresh dose of air to keep it cool. But what about contagious yawning? While there is no conclusive evidence for this, it is most likely believed to be because of empathy. Empathy is an emotion that develops in early years of growth in both humans and animals and is defined as the ability to understand and share the feelings of one another. It is because of this feeling that we are much more likely to mimic a yawn of a close family member or a friend as compared to a stranger. The other reason for this contagious behavior is because of mirror neurons. These neurons are activated when we see others perform certain behaviors like yawning, thereby leading us to do the same. These neurons are important for learning, self-awareness and relating to others. Another example would be when you unconsciously might copy the posture of the person sitting next to you because it might feel more comfortable. There are no known harmful effects of yawning, but as we discussed earlier, it is a signal from the brain to the body that it needs a coolant to perform more efficiently. An experiment was also conducted to prove this, where one group of participants was asked to put a hot packet on their head, while the other to put an ice pack to cool the head down. This experiment concluded that the group with the hot packet yawned 41% of the time, while the other one with the ice pack yawned only at a 9% rate. So if you yawn while watching someone else, remember that is completely normal and you are just cooling your brain down. If you enjoyed watching this, please do like the video and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching.